You are going to continue your project by creating four small walls, north, south, east, and west. Some of the walls are going to be 10 by 10 or 100 square feet. There are 6.752 brick units per square foot. This wall would then have 675 brick. Simple walls with simple calculations that you can do in your head so that you may come to understand how the program works. Let us get started. With any project or takeoff, you need to know what materials and specifications are required. You, of course, will refer to your blueprint and specifications book for this information before starting a project. You are now going to go into our database and select the materials for your ABC project. Note, materials can be marked or created at any point during your takeoff. You are not limited to doing this procedure at this time. You will develop your own methods, but for the purpose of this walkthrough, you're going to select your materials from the existing database before you start building your wall. Your ABC project is going to contain 8-inch block, modular brick, 12-inch wire, and some flashing. Proceed to the top row of icons on your wall screen and click on the materials icon, which can be identified by the three rows of bricks. This will bring you to the project material screen. Just a reminder that you can confirm the screen by looking for the name at the top of your screen. The main part of your screen should be blank since this is a new project and you have not brought your materials into it yet. You are now going to copy existing standard materials from the database. Proceed to click on the button in the lower right portion of the screen that says Copy Marked Standard Materials. You are now on the Standard Materials screen. This screen contains over 450 standard materials that you have to choose from. Later on in the walkthrough, I will teach you how to create your own materials. You will also be shown how to customize existing materials. You will be able to enter your own prices, lay rates, and change dimensions. For now, we are going to select a few material items for our basic takeoff. Once you enter this screen, your keyboard controls will automatically default to the search box in the upper left portion of your screen. This is where you will type the class or material ID when looking for a material. Type in the letters B R I. This will bring you directly to the BRI or brick classification in your database. Now add the letter M after BRI and it will bring you to the modular bricks since their material ID starts with M. Now you will need to mark your material to be brought into the project. Left click on the checkbox located to the left of the class and material ID. If done properly, a check mark will appear in the checkbox. Mark the modular brick now. Note, you can also move through your material database by using the down and up arrows located on your keyboard. Now, let's proceed and mark the CMU that is needed for your ABC project. Type in CMUMW08 in the search box. This will bring you to the medium weight 8-inch block in the materials database. Mark the CMU now. Flashing would be next on your list. Type in FLAPVC. This will bring you to the PVC flashing. Mark the 18-inch flashing now. And finally, you are going to add wire to the list. Type in W I R H D T. This will bring you to Hot Dip Truss Wire. Mark the 9 gauge 12 inch Hot Dip Truss Wire now. Remember, if you forget or miss some materials, you can come back at any point in your project and mark them. You are now going to bring the marked materials into your project database. Click on the Copy Mark Materials button, 
which is located in the lower right corner of your screen. This will return you to the Project Materials screen. You should now see your four materials listed on this screen. Once you have your materials, click on the Close button located in the lower right corner of the Project Materials screen. This will bring you back to the Walls and Projects screen. This might be a good time to take a look at some of the features this screen has to offer. Pause the walkthrough and press the F1 key to bring up the Help file. 